everyone. I hope you all are doing great in your life. So in this video, we are going to talk about the latest hiring of Wipro, which is basically for analyst role. And this hiring is for someone who has no experience, such as they could be fresher, or if you have one years of experience, two years of experience, and it can go up to five years of experience. So someone who is uh, looking for a job in analytics position or associate roles are also there. But majorly, the hiring is for analyst role and. The eligibility criteria I will show you in the video later. But yeah, the eligibility criteria is basic eligibility criteria for someone is uh, to have a degree in any relevant field or maybe in any field. So anyone is a uh, applicable for applying to this position, and anyone can apply to this. And the job location is Pan India, so they have centers across all over the country, be it Bangalore, Pune, Hyderabad, in the north maybe uh, New Delhi, Gurgaon, or Noida. So they have multiple centers and you can choose any or whatever suits your location based on your preference. You can do that and this is actually for the analyst role so do not skip this video. Uh, watch this video till the end because I'm going to be sharing everything on uh, the computer screen. I will show you how you can apply to this position and what is your uh, desired role. So yeah, let's go into the computer screen and see what you can do with this hiring and whether this opportunity is for you or not. Also, Wipro is uh, some company that hire people in bulk. So this is a bulk opportunity. If you have applied for this, you will be getting an interview call. Just one thing to remember is that you have to make a resume that is ATS friendly or the resume should have something related to analytics so that your resume could get shortlisted. So th these are things that you have to uh, keep in mind. If you can get a referral for uh, any uh, role that is present on LinkedIn or on their career portal, that is well enough. And you can uh, search these kind of jobs through LinkedIn or through their career portal. Both of these are valid ways to search these jobs for. So yeah, let's, uh, without wasting any time, we have to move to the screen and see what is there for you. Yeah. So here I'm on my LinkedIn profile. This is my LinkedIn profile and I am four times Salesforce certified. I have also analytics experience. So in case you want to connect with me on LinkedIn, I'm already there. And the next thing that I'm gonna do over here is moving to the job section and see the Wipro job applications. Okay, let's uh, correct it to India. And I'm gonna search over here Wipro. Let's see what kind of jobs are, 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 are present over here. So they are hiring for Salesforce developer. So around 1700 jobs are there uh, currently and yeah if you look at over here most of these are the analysts role but uh, we have to like uh, search for which one of them is suited best for us so then uh, only we could think of applying so this is for the Salesforce business analyst role this is uh, somewhere similar to my role whatever uh, the things that I am currently doing but this requires three years of experience so I'm sure this is not valid uh, job for you Let's look at uh, the system analyst rule. Okay, so this is uh, uh, the thing that you can apply for because they have not mentioned any criteria. And system analyst role is a very basic role. Uh, like you can start your career with system analyst role. So this is what something that you could look for. And there, there is another uh, job role that is for analyst. So here also you will see that this is for uh, fresher only. Uh, build customization using extension and scripts some things that you need to know from your end uh, if you're searching for a uh, analyst role and all of this if you look if they are not data analyst role they are analyst role whatever you have learned in your uh, uh, analyst uh, training or maybe self-learning this is something that is going to be like exactly the similar uh, approach that you have followed. So this is a uh, service desk analyst rule. You should have a uh, two, three years of experience of service desk. So someone who has an uh, experience of two years, they can apply for this rule. Then another uh, rule for uh, like say senior analyst. So I'm sure this is not a valid one for you, but wherever you see this analyst thing mentioned, this is for you. Graduate in commerce with one to two years of experience. So this is a great opportunity and if you have HR uh, experience or if you want to shift to HR domain this is something that you could look for and they have it for freshers as well I'll, I'll show you because I have 
been through each of the posts that they have posted so i can say that this is the the thing that you could look for and going back to here data analyst i'm sure you must be excited to see this one so yes you should have the functional uh, competency skills so basically they will judge you on basis of the analytics skills that you already know so this is going to be a opportunity for you that is actually very great thing to look for because let's say i'll move to past week jobs okay so i'm here 1002 posts are there and i'm just going to move to analyst because i know this is for you so if you if uh, you look for these kind of uh, jobs uh, that are newly posted i'm sure you're going to get the interview calls but just be selective of uh, what you're applying to you can also go move for this systems engineer role this is also uh, for a fresh fresher who is looking for a job all you need to know is uh, how to document how to basic troubleshooting that you have done in either engineering or your uh, like in your journey uh, of graduation basically we know these kind of thing and if you are enthusiast i'm sure uh, i don't have to say a lot about it you will know by yourself so please please be mindful of what exactly the job you are applying and if you can get a referral please go ahead and get it because with referral you could be uh, like getting these jobs very easily and next step is yes here is a apply link so this will redirect you to their uh, career portal on uh, uh, the wipro site and here everything is mentioned all you have to do is apply basically they would ask you to uh, fill in certain information that you uh, have with yourself and login so this is somewhere you can apply and yeah i hope you uh, make good use of this hiring opportunity because uh, very rarely you will get uh, bulk hiring in analyst or data analyst role and this is something that you should go ahead and just grab this opportunity also you could go for these kind of roles as well l2 tech support engineer because the chances of getting hired are extremely high for such roles as a fresher so yeah this was it for this video if you have any doubt write in the comment section below and please apply to these roles i would have uh, told you the entire process but the problem here is that they would have my data and they will start contacting me so i don't want to do that but yes you have to do it because yes you want to get connected with the job uh, with hiring uh, teams so yeah this is your opportunity just go ahead with this one yeah bye bye for now until we meet next time thank you